toes, all in primer. Um, I'll probably do a little sanding on it, especially on the little tabs over here. These are really, really rough. The rest of this is not bad. I'll just lightly sand it before I paint this here. I might do a little bit of filling on those. I don't want to make it perfect, but it's really crude. And then uh, we'll give it a coat of gloss black paint. And I think what I have decided on the tank itself that we are not going to go for perfection. I was going to, I was going to try and really buff this thing right out and really make it shine. And I do have a buffering wheel somewhere, but I, I'm not sure where it is at the moment. It's packed away with a lot of my other stuff. Um, as many of you know, we've had our house in the market since last July, I think, the end of July. And let me swing around here. Well, you can see, this is a lot of my stuff that's uh, packed up here in the basement. So I got piles and piles of stuff, and a lot of my uh, some of my tools are packed in there, including my buffing wheel, so I'm not going to go for that. Thankfully, I still have my basic tools out and, you know, some of the things like my grinder and my drill press and so forth I haven't put away. Uh, I haven't packed, which I'm packed before. So, I think we're going to be happy with it like this and uh, add the other part back onto it. Um, you know, it's cleaned up, it's not perfect, but then it's not perfect to begin with. I'm going to leave the dark stuff in here, leave the patina. You can see the um, copper color on the ends here, especially where I had it in the dipping solution for a while. And uh, now that my new radiator cap that I just got today doesn't fit, uh, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do. I've got a couple of thoughts in mind. Find a radiator cap that does fit it, or maybe I could put a light in there, you know. This is probably going to be hanging up on the wall, something like this, you know. Um, let me back you up a little bit so you can see a little bit better. Probably going to be hanging up on the wall on that idea. And I don't know, I thought about putting a light in here, like an LED light or something like that. Use it as a night light, but who knows? Anyway, uh, that's where we're at. And uh, thanks for watching. And I'll update you again once I get that up, uh, other part painted black and uh, we get it all assembled. Thanks again. Bye.